Ten toes, that's my MO. What it do, what it do, y'all. We in this thing. What's up? You trying to be in the video? No, no. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hey, this video is going to be about some new equipment that we got. All this stuff showed up a couple of days ago. Um, we got a vehicle in the back that uh, we picked up the other day that needs to go tomorrow. So we may try some of this stuff out with uh, that vehicle and just show y'all what we got. So let's get it open. We got this uh, piece that y'all saw Stay Ready used the other day. Um, and the way it works is... See, the way it works is come back here, follow me. You're supposed to be able to use this part as you, you hook to that, and then right here, you can go over an axle or something. So, if you ain't got no way to hook your hooks in under the frame or nothing like that. You can hook this over your axle or over your A-arm or whatever. And then you can you can drag it. I seen him use it that day and I was like, oh, I gotta get that. So, matter of fact, that Toyota we ran yesterday. We could have used it then. Could've put this over the back control arm or rear axle or whatever and, and dragged it without trying to find them holes that I found in the uh, back of the uh, bumper frame. So, we got that. Uh, let's see what else we got, what else we got? I got some extra, all these are, are extra um, things that we use to go through the tire. Bought them by themselves. So I always keep two in the back. So my green ones, my green ones are, they still work, but. Dingy. Oh, these actually got the, what you call? I can move it over though. I can move it from that to these. Yeah, I'm gonna start using these and keep these as back. But <laughs> well, yeah, I bought three of these just to, uh, kind of put these into rotation and get the green ones and make them backups. So that's the second thing we got. We got some tire skates, man. People have been telling me to get these for a while. Can you guess what you use these for? No. So apparently you're supposed to be able to, I think you're supposed to be able to put it like this. You, uh, you lift it or something drive it on. I don't think you drive it on. I guess you lift it and you put that under and then you can pull it up if you had uh, ramps like the other trailer. Not like these ramps. Uh -huh. These got holes in them. Or if you had a, a tow truck. If you had a tow truck that was didn't need ramps, you know, you let the bed down you can put that on top of that and it's plastic and it's supposed to slide. See what I'm saying? They yeah. call that a tire skate. So not really usable with this setup unless it's something I'm not seeing right, but that's got holes in the ramps, you know what I'm saying? So that, that, that wouldn't work for that. It probably would work for the other trailer though with the mesh ramp on the 24 foot, so. People been telling me to get those for a while, so I got some of those. Let's see what this is. Oh yeah, this is another one of these. I got one of these on the 24 foot. This is for when you're hauling a truck or something. And uh, it's got a hitch, or any car that's got a hitch. You can put this in the hitch and just pull it from directly in the center. See what I'm saying? Yeah. Let's say the dually was bad. Let's say the dually wasn't running right. You can put this in the hitch right there and put yeah, your hook pull, in there pull, and pull it straight without needing to go up underneath to the frame and nothing like that. So I needed one of these for a while. I'm gonna put that in there and just keep it as a spare. You got your bowl all in my way, boy. Who had this? That was homie. So, stuff like that, you just put it in. I need to clean this out and get it all tidied up. Uh, Ooh. Boy! Yeah, I don't know what the, what the hell this last one is. Let's see what this last one is right here. Ah, spare tire carrier, yeah, that's right. The most important piece. This thing was on sale, man, because the bolts, something with the bolts. I had to, I can't remember, I had to go back to the website. But anyway, we're gonna take, probably take one of these out. Back up a little bit, son, y'all in my face. One of 
of these out and do something like this. Yeah, that one don't hardly fit. It's just gonna hold it. Yeah, it don't even hardly fit, really. Let's try another one. And you can't just like pound it down here. Look, e trailer, man. That's the problem. See how it's flat on that side? Yeah. Look how it's raised on that side. Uh, it's too wide. Can you see that? Yeah. It's raised on that side. It's flat on that side. That little bit right there won't let it won't let it go in there. I'll probably shave it down. See look. So that side going in, is it? Mm-hmm. But that side won't. I'll grab the, the grinder and grind it down. Come on, Bill. Does it go this way? No. I can't go this way. It seems like it's out kind of far, don't it? Yeah. Like this. Man, wouldn't the tire stick out even further? Put it on it? Well, no, the tire, you would put the inside of the tire so it would. Uh. You see what I'm saying? It'd be on the, the inner dish. That does look a little weird. It was on sale though for $24, so it was worth it. But I do gotta damn fix it. Quality control these days ain't worth a damn, man. Um, all right, let's get this out of here, man. We're gonna get that truck around here. That truck runs and drives, but not very good. The brakes are horrible in it, too. But we'll see if we can use Probably not use those, but we'll use, we'll try this out. Mm -hmm. Try that out instead of using the winch. And uh, it, should, it should be straight. Let's go back here and get it. Y'all look at this knucklehead. He ain't supposed to be trying, he ain't supposed to be damn bringing that thing around, man. <laughs> man, what you doing, man? I told you the brakes was a little messed up. Line it up, man. Don't go out in the road now. Turn it. You gotta, you gotta reverse it and go out. Back it up. Turn it, turn it in the back. You don't start it now. That's good. Come forward. Line up. The ramp's only five feet. Come on. Just want you to line up. That's good right there. All right, we got it lined up. We're going to try to give this thing a shot. Let me see what's under this truck. I drove this thing up here. It drives like doo doo. So they got control arms. They got control arms that we could do it on, but let me see. Let's test. Let's just see how it look. Come on this side. Oh, isn't it? You probably can see it. Yeah. So basically, that's how it, that's how it will work. You wrap it around something, and then you you got a strong uh what's it called? Let me see. Maybe y'all can see that or not? It's dark under here. You wrap it around, pull it on itself, clamp it. Of course, you have the other one on the other side. Then you pull on it. So. I ain't gonna do it right now because y'all know, y'all know my OCD, man. I don't want to mess it up, and this truck drives, so we ain't gonna dirty up our new equipment. Here, grab it. We ain't gonna dirty up our new equipment. Ah. Oh. But what we will do 
is use our new straps right there. I got an issue though. These are 12, 12 uh, feet, bro. Nothing. The old ones are like 10 or eight. I like these not being that long. Stretch that out. Stretch it on the floor. That's the only issue. And I looked for some tins before I bought these. I couldn't, they didn't have any. Pull that one. Yeah, these might even be eights. Look at that. Damn. I don't like that. I don't like that being that long. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, I don't like that. That's more for going around big ass tires. That's gonna be a lot left excess. You know what I'm saying? Damn. So these gotta be, is that a four foot difference? These gotta be eight foot then. These ain't even 10. Here, hold that. Yeah, I don't like having all that excess right there. All that slack. Yep, just less than eight foot. Damn. So these 12? Yeah. Could, could, damn uh, well. Well, no. Can you chop them in? You can up? cut it and burn the end. But then I wonder if it'll fit in the damn, fit in the ratchet. I don't know, I have to do some research. Damn it, man. That's all good. Me no like that. Me no like that too long. All right, let's get this thing over there. You want me to drive it up? Hey, you want? Cause you got, uh, I'm telling you, them brakes. Them brakes kind of. Yeah, I hit them like at that tree back there and I coasted up onto the, I coasted up onto the concrete. Yeah, this gonna be this gonna be valuable. We could have used that yesterday for sure. Yeah. It made a big difference. I think I'm gonna take these things back off. That's too long, man. Let's see if I can return them. That's that's that's, that's too long. Ah. I gotta get it almost all the way up there. You might want to hop down. You might want to turn this way a bit. Yeah. You can go that way a little bit. How much speed I got? In the back? Come on, come on. To the yeah, it's not that much. Excess, I believe. Let's give it a shot. Who that thing is leaking some kind of oil or something? If I can cut this mug, I will. I just don't know. It looks like it's kind of. Yeah, it's like that's, that, that's how they do it. Maybe they just cut it and burn it. Y'all drop a comment, man. Will that work? Can I cut it and can I do that? I guess I could keep it. I ain't paid much for them, but maybe down the line somewhere it'll be. It'll find some use. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Look how long that is. Look how much excess I have. <laughs> Hell no. That's how that's gonna look. I have so much left over. I, <laughs> I did it wrong. Oh no, I don't know if you didn't fold it a couple times. I always call it during a video. 
Oh, you can't fit that through there. It's too long, man. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. El Vizo! Yeah. Vija Fee. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. Step on them. Then this thing will cut it like butter. Mm -hmm. You can hear it. Push. Snap. Pretty clean cut, what do you think? Yeah. You ready? Mm -hmm. I got a heat gun, but I don't think that'll work as good. I'm not trying to do flatten it up. Yeah, this uh It'll make it make the bottom like it like it was on the when we started. Sometimes you just gotta try stuff to learn, man. You feel me? Mm-hmm. It's hot. What do you think? What do you think, Bray Low? What's sending sharks here? In the like swim well. Then I left a little bit. I left just. Oh, damn. Messing up. Let's go down here. What do you think, Bray Low? What do you think, my boy? I think that was pretty good. Look at that. I left a little extra, because sometimes when I do have to go around the tire, like if it's, uh, like if I can't fit it through the tire pretty good, like I like, I have to go around it. And on big tires, sometimes it, it ain't long enough. That's why I lift it about nine feet. But now I know. If I need to, I can cut it back down, you know? Yeah. So then we gotta cut the other ones now, don't we? Yeah. Might even go shorter, huh? 
Leave one long and one short. about eight foot or a little shorter. Look, we'll give it a shot. I cut this one a little shorter. Let's see what we're looking like. Oh, move that. Just right. slide it over. You gotta pick it up. That good? As long as I can get rid of it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a little bit better. Nice little project. I learned something. I can cut them things down, cut them down, and make up the length that I want. I'm put these in the. I'm gonna put these in the 24 foot. Over these go to the 24 foot. Now all I gotta do. These are gonna go to the 24 foot too, but these ain't gonna work on here. And neither ramp, cause they got them ramps got holes in them too. So I put these in the 24 foot. All right, y'all. Uh, I don't think I got time to put the spare tire thing on just yet. Uh, I might. I don't know. We'll have to see. I might do it another day. Might still have to hit that piece right there, is it? Give it a try. Mm hmm Gotta come all the way across. Still too hot right there. Alright. Trial and error. Quality control on shit these days, boy, ain't worth a damn. Thing burning? No. One of hit my leg. Burn. Yeah. Right. Damn it, man. Do some more. I'm gonna fast forward and just show y'all when it's done. All right, we got this thing grinded down, but I ain't too happy with the way it uh it's fitting in there. So you see, I grinded it down so it'll go down in there. But it still, this whole this thing is kind of off. So I assume it's supposed to go in like that, and this is supposed to come like that. But uh, it doesn't line up. I can't get this in. And keep it keep it outside like that it's not lining up i tried it every way so this junk i paid 24 dollars for it on closeout it was supposed to be like 50 i think it's 50 on amazon they had it on closeout that's probably why because it's junk but uh i ain't happy with it i might modify it some more or move the hole in this thing and use a washer or something that'll be for next time i'm tired tired of dealing with it just gonna go back in the box might go back where it came from here. Yeah. That's it. The rest of the products work good. Uh, we should have good look. We should have, uh, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. We should have a good ordeal with it, I guess. That's it for now. We're going to get out of here, man. It's getting dark. We hungry. We're going to holler at y'all. Appreciate y'all watching. Like, share, subscribe. Peace. Peace.